time You ain't with it, what's the whole up? Never in a rush, but when we moving, why you slow up? Killer on this bitch and we got killer shit to roll up Got it going down, trying to get this shit to go up I ain't in Atlanta, but I make these bitches go Man, what's cracking, YouTube? It's your girl, Shada, the GOAT Number 1 with another video, man, for y'all boys and y'all girls, man. Listen, I just uploaded a video. I got two more that's on the way, y'all. If y'all have not checked the video videos out, go ahead and check the videos out right now. My Mike Tyson uh raps video, y'all. It is age restricted, so you gotta be 18 to watch that video, y'all. And since my last video got age restricted, we finna do do it a little different this time. If y'all really want to see the pre-rolls up close and personal and see them, go subscribe to my Patreon. It will be in the description below. It is $5. You must be 18 to join. That's why I'm going to be putting exclusive content that I cannot post here on YouTube. So that's where you can go catch a girl at if you want to see exclusive content. You feel what I'm saying? But in today's video, y'all, I went to the smoke shop earlier today, this morning. Like around 8.30 this morning, y'all. Swear to God, 9 o'clock this morning. Went to the smoke shop because I ran out of weed last night and my plug was asleep. He just hit me back, y'all, and told me that he up, but nigga, it's too late. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not, I'm not, I don't plan on copping. He said, I am now. I said, you up? He said, I am now. I don't need the weed now. You feel what I'm saying? And I didn't have to spend as much money as i would have if i would have went to him yeah y'all so i have a local smoke shop that's not too far from me it's like 1.4 miles away from me y'all i'm right on kind of like the border if you if you live in the northwest indiana if you live in the northwest man you indiana you know you know what i'm saying so i'm on a border like damn near uh, like lansing going into chicago and shit so Y'all, this dispensary, I've been going to this, this I've been going to this dispensary for a little minute now, y'all. And I always seen these pre-rolls and ask questions about them, y'all. And they said they be getting motherfuckers hot. Like they be selling out of them motherfuckers. So I'm like, today, I'ma go ahead and cop me some pre-rolls and see what it's smoking on. And y'all finna y'all finna see with me, bruh. Now I can show y'all. I can show y'all what I copped. Okay, I got the BK India. I mean, Indica. I don't know why I keep saying India. I know somebody named India, but this ain't India. BK Indica. Then I got the GG Hybrid. And then I got the SD Sativa, y'all. So I cop. So I cop three different ones, y'all. I don't know which one I should start off with, but I ain't gonna lie. I think I should start off with the motherfucking. Damn, should I start off with it, Sativa or Indica, y'all? Because I'm going to say my little hybrid. I think I'm going to start off with the Indica. I'm going to start off with the Indica, y'all. I'm going to start off with the Indica and save the Sativa. Y'all, one thing I did notice when she was pulling these out for me, I asked her, could I smell them? They did smell good. But now they kind of don't smell like anything, honestly. Uh, not really. They don't really have a nose to them. You feel what I'm saying? My, my nigga Mr. TAC be saying nose. They don't have really like a nose to them, y'all. But you know the street weed, they be putting shit up in that to make it smell good and be strong like that. Weed naturally doesn't... It's not naturally as strong like that for real, y'all. So this is my first time trying to pre-rolls from the smoke shop, y'all. I don't really smoke with uh, pre-rolls like that from the smoke shop, but this is my first time, y'all. I'm just finna smoke it real quick and let y'all know the results and what I think about it. Smell, I already told y'all. I don't really have a smell. So now we finna just see like how this shit smoke and how this shit tastes when we inhale it. So let's go ahead and start that off right now. And I'ma um, rate the smell once it's lit, y'all. So let's see. Let's get into it. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. It smell like weed, but without that musty smell. I ain't gonna lie. So far, it just it smell like weed. Nah, they got a little must to it. I lied. There you go. It smell like weed. It's just not the zaza weed smell. You know what I'm saying? If y'all know, y'all know. But 
Wait a minute. Wait a minute, y'all. This actually got a good... I ain't gonna lie. The taste, I give it, honestly, taste-wise, y'all. Smell-wise, smell-wise, I'm gonna give it a solid ass 7.5. Taste-wise... Taste-wise, I'm gonna give it an 8. On the taste, I'm gonna give it an 8, and I'm gonna tell y'all why. Because it literally smell, it literally tastes like the weed I've been smoking that I get from my plug. It literally tastes like that. Yeah, it literally tastes like that. It tastes like some good ass OG. <coughs> Definitely not Za. But it has a good smell to it. And I asked Shorty, was this shit gonna give me a nice little high? She said, oh yeah, y'all should have seen, I didn't record it, but y'all should have seen how she said, oh yeah, because she smoked these bitches. Well, used to. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, so seven, so far we got a seven on the smell, an eight on the taste. And now we just got to see how this bitch make me feel in a few minutes, you feel what I'm saying? somebody don't like my story on instagram appreciate y'all y'all and i didn't even spend a whole ten dollars i had 51 cents of points racked up which i don't even know why the fuck my points ain't more than that because i been gave them niggas my number like a couple of months ago a few months ago and i thought i was but it's cool i i i re i re put my number in that system y'all so i had used my little points today 51 cent so it was really nine dollars and it was nine sixty, so it was like nine dollars and nine cent or something like that, y'all. For three of these, for three of these bitches, they had four, but I just got three up. <coughs> so three of these <coughs> for under ten dollars. And if I get a nice buzz from this shit, y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I told her I'm gonna start fucking with these a little bit more. I don't really usually do pre-rolls, especially from the smoke shop, but this kind of a legit for uh smoke shop. They got a 4.3 star. So they damn now five star for real. So and I ain't gonna lie, I'm already starting to feel like hot. Like I'm feeling a difference already. Dog barking outside, you might smell the weed, you feel what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie, y'all, I'll be keeping my window cracked. Sometimes just to air it out a little bit. And whenever dogs outside, I ain't gonna lie, they be smelling the gas and they be barking and shit. But that's how I know this got a good smell to it. Because if he barking, my neighbor's dog barking, there's some good shit. That nigga like a watchdog, a police dog or something. That nigga know what weed smell like. I'm telling y'all. But this the, this the pre-roll right here, y'all. We ain't even smoked half of it yet. I am feeling a little buzz. I ain't gonna lie, I'm feeling a little buzz. Remember, y'all, it's the DK Indica. So I'm smoking that Indica right now. And the Indica, I ain't gonna lie. It's smooth. Like, <clears throat> it's not too spicy. You know how, like, if you if you have smoked pre-rolls before. Because I ain't gonna lie, I have smoked a pre-roll before. But that was in Texas, y'all. At a local gas station that was literally walking this from my uh, suite that I was staying at the whole time I was out there, y'all. And they had pre-rolls and right at the end, like I'm talking about literally like my last month living out there, I finally fucked around and bought one. Cause my plug at the time, RP to him, I did a story time on him, y'all. Not too long ago, like a month ago. He passed away, y'all. And he was my plug. So I ain't gonna lie, he wasn't fucking with me. Cause I used to ask him, like, is these any good? He like, man, you better off copping from me. So y'all never fucked with the pre-rolls for real out there in Texas, but I did come across one night where I ain't had no weed, no plugs really in sight, and I really didn't feel like spending no money on actual weed, y'all. And the pre-roll was seven dollars. <throat> Man, y'all, y'all just told y'all each pre-roll was two ninety-nine. It was three dollars and like six cent each for each pre-roll. You feel what I'm saying? Six cent, nine cent, something like that. That pre-roll was like it was seven dollars, bro. I ain't gonna lie, the pre-roll it did it for the night, but I wouldn't pay seven dollars. But I'll pay three dollars for some, you know what I'm saying? That's gonna get me hot. And right now I'm already feeling the difference, like I said, y'all. 
I'm already feeling like, <clears throat> and it's the indica. I'm already feeling like, I'm already feeling the high, but I'm like, it's not za, so I'm not like to the moon yet. But I'm high, like I know I'm not sober right now. You feel what I'm saying? So I ain't gonna lie. Just for a little quick fix though, <clears throat> sound like a fiend, bro. Sound like a fucking fiend. Goddamn. But for a quick fix, man, I ain't gonna lie. For three dollars, not bad. You're not gonna beat it. I ain't gonna lie to you. My plug probably ain't gonna see me as much no more. He ain't gonna see me as much no more anyways because I'm finna slow down on these hoes real quick. You feel what I'm saying? But I'm not gonna lie. <clears throat> the pre-roll is pre-rolling and I like that shit. I thought it was gold. I thought it was gonna honestly be a waste of fucking money, y'all. But it's really not. <coughs> It even got me coughing a little bit. But a nigga definitely getting a little high off of it. You can kind of see the oil. I don't know if y'all can see that, but you can kind of see, like, the burning of the oil and shit. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna smoke the other two. <coughs> I might or might not smoke the other two on camera. But I feel like I should just get a, a full review of all three of them. So yeah, yeah, y'all. I spent basically ten dollars this morning for this shit, and I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm not gonna lie. Like, a nigga is high. I feel relaxed, I feel calmer than I did this morning. I'm fucking with it. Good, good smoke. They really did stuff this bitch too. Like this bitch smoking better than mine. Maybe it's cause I don't be stuffing that whole enough. <clears throat> Okay, y'all, I'm back. It's been like a good, maybe like 10 minutes, y'all. I'm feeling good. My eyes is kind of low, reddish a little bit. Nothing too crazy. I need to charge my camera. So before I die, y'all, make sure y'all like this video. Hit that subscribe button. And make sure you tap that notification bell so you can be uh, so you can be notified when your girl Shade of Goat is dropping another video. Yeah, man, I'm feeling good. I'm actually finna smoke the rest of that. And I got two videos dropping for y'all and then this one. So y'all just be on the lookout. Make sure y'all showing love and supporting your girl. You feel what I'm saying? It's only up from here. Hey, and since my last video got age restricted, we're going to have to be on point from now on. You know what I'm saying? And I'm really going to have to, like, slow down on smoking on this channel. But that don't mean y'all ain't going to never get no smoking videos. You feel what I'm saying? Y'all just got another one. But just lock in. You feel me? We out. What's good, gang? What's good, squad? I ain't gonna lie, y'all. It's been a, a couple of hours. It's definitely been a few hours, y'all, since I smoked the last, uh... Damn, what did I smoke? I smoked Indica. Since I smoked the Indica, uh, pre-roll from the, uh, smoke shop. You feel what I'm saying? So, it's been, like, dead ass, y'all, like, a few hours, though. Oh, my mama, it's, like, two-something right now, so... That was earlier this morning, so right now, y'all, I ain't gonna lie... Right now, y'all, I'm finna smoke the sativa one and get y'all a little review on that. I really didn't think I was gonna smoke any other one for this video, but I'm like, shit, fuck it. I might as well. They, all three of them came together. All three of them gonna get smoked together. And all three need a review together. So that's what we finna do right now, y'all. I'm finna review the sativa. We got that motherfucker right over here, too. Y'all, yeah. there we go. You feel me? There we go. The Sanini, the Sativa. Yeah, we finna smoke that bitch right now, y'all. Right now, you feel what I'm saying? So let me prop this bitch up real quick. And I'm gonna show y'all. I'm, I'm gonna smoke it and light it up with y'all. And, and let y'all know how it's hitting, you feel? Yeah, I know y'all can see a nigga. Y'all can see a nigga, right? Let me know how y'all liking the quality, y'all. We shooting out the cannon, baby. Here we go right here. This is the sativa, y'all. So these are the two. We already smoked the BK Indica. We already smoked that. Gave our little review. That was a 7. 7.5. Then I think another 7. 
So the all overall on that was probably like a cooler 7.5 altogether. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, no, overall, y'all, I ain't gonna lie. Overall, I give it a six. I like overall, it's a six. Overall, it's a six, 6.5, give or take. It's not really like my go to. I wouldn't hit up the smoke shop necessarily all the time for this shit, but on rainy days or like times like this, when a plug went up fast enough for me, it is what it is. Wait, that was the sativa? Okay. But I'm smoking an SD sativa right now, y'all. That's this. So let's flame this up real quick and just give our love. You know, our rates on like how it's smoking shit. You feel what I'm saying? How it smoke, how it smell, how it taste, and you know how it smoke, how I feel like this. So this the sativa. Let's go ahead and light the whole up. Light the bitch up. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, y'all, so I bought three of them. You know what I'm saying? One was an indica, this sativa, and then I have a hybrid. Uh, they all smell the same. I ain't gonna cap to you. Like the burn, the same. Okay, it tastes slightly different though. Slightly different. Slightly different, y'all. Not even gonna capture y'all. This is it tastes slightly different. You can tell they probably made by the same company and shit, but <coughs> slight difference on the taste, I ain't gonna lie. Smell, we're gonna give it a 7 to 6.5, you know. 6.57 on on the nose. But then like how it tastes. Cool little seven, two. So damn near the same numbers as the first one, y'all. I ain't gonna lie to you. It tastes good. Who catching clouds for real, though? Y'all, I don't even do clouds for real no more like that, but I do. It's kind of like a habit. Like, I don't do them like that, like, purposely. But if I do it, y'all, it's just natural, like... Gotta catch them bitches though. Oh god, you gotta catch them hoes. They be running from me, but I <laughs> catch them bitches. Yeah. Let's do another cloud. If y'all watch V Long, tell him I'm coming for him. That nigga swear he the best ghoster, bro. V long. We can get us a video in, nigga, and we can see who goes <coughs> the best for real. If y'all watch high off V long, uh, BTS of V long, y'all know who that nigga is. Nigga be snapping. He a young nigga. But he be snapping. He be in his bag in his YouTube shit. I ain't gonna lie. That's my dog. He younger than me, but on some real shit, I look up to that nigga and how he move on some real shit. Like, it just motivated motherfucker to go. Hard, cause I know I can do this shit too. You feel what I'm saying? And that's one of the ones I watch y'all with the smoking shit. Y'all like smoking videos? I ain't gonna lie. Go watch this shit. He dope. Don't not watch my shit though. Now, come on now, watch my shit too. But I'm just saying, like, one day y'all might see me smoking and puffing on the gas with V Long. I heard that nigga, his shit be hit different. I heard that nigga be putting something like flavor. Something, you know what I'm saying? His shit just don't smoke like other niggas shit smoke, I heard. But who ghosting though, for real? Who ghosting for real though? Make sure y'all go fuck with my Patreon. I'm finna be dropping some videos on that motherfucker either to night or tomorrow. Whenever I drop these next to, uh, whenever I drop this, this, this video, y'all, I'm gonna uh, have videos on my Patreon. So be on the lookout for that. I ain't gonna lie, this shit in though. Like, I feel it. In my chest, nigga. <coughs> hey.
What the maybe? Maybe I'll take that. <coughs> wait, wait. Maybe I'll. be on TikTok more often y'all just get jiggy living life having fun bro if you not living life and having fun like you gotta really take life by the horns and make it your bitch you feel what I'm saying and if you not doing that bro I don't know what to tell you <coughs> cause listen they print money every day motherfuckers making money every day Motherfuckers making moves every day. So honestly, if you not wanna if you not where you at in life, honestly, you need to take a look at yourself. Take a look, a real good look at yourself. Take a look in the mirror. Go somewhere private and have a conversation with just you and God on, on some real shit. And God will start revealing things to y'all that y'all need to start doing. If you feel like, damn, why I'm still Talk to God. Get some alone time. Stop fucking with your friends all the damn time. On the phone. Gossiping. Y'all, I just watched a real powerful video today. And it just really showed me, like... <clears throat> a lot of times, while life be seeming so fast for motherfuckers, because they be worried about the next motherfucker. They gossiping and talking about these people. You know what I'm saying? Instead of focusing on yourself. You know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> a lot of people out here lost for real. And I ain't gonna sit here and say I ain't never felt lost or been lost before in my life, y'all. But I'm I'm really finding myself, you feel what I'm saying? And I think there's kind of the gas <clears throat> creeping up on me right now. I ain't gonna lie. I'm starting to feel high again. Hey, y'all. <coughs> Anyways, y'all, yeah. Uh, my fault. I had to get that out. But, um, yeah, man, just just stay in your own lane. Focus on yourself, bro. People don't believe that there is a heaven or a hell. I, I honestly am starting to believe that more and more now. Myself, like, at the end of it all, we, we got to go somewhere else. You feel what I'm saying? And a lot of people, <clears throat> he was, I was watching this video, y'all. I'm going to make a whole, I should make a whole separate, that's probably what I'm going to do. But I'm going to still say what I got to say right now. <clears throat> but I was watching this video, video y'all. Of a man that's from an older gentleman that became a gang member at the age of 12 and 13 he said real young you know what I'm saying and now he's probably like in his late 40s early 50s right <coughs> somewhere up in there right I know he got to be in his 40s for sure but he um he was just saying like how he had like this incident y'all where he really like he's still here and everything but he really like had a chance to see what hell was like and it just made me think about myself and my loved ones and ones I love most. Like, I don't want none of us going to hell. You feel what I'm saying? So, and they said, and, and one thing he was saying, though, that I, I really listened when he said this shit is that he saw motherfuckers in hell that he didn't think was going to be in hell. Like, it was motherfuckers that was going to church every day, y'all. <clears throat> he was talking about this one lady in, in specific. Like, she went to church and everything. But he was also talking about like it's women that's in hell for being too promiscuous and like how the demons and down in hell was like they was having intercourse with her y'all doing her in but not in a way that like we do it you know what i'm saying like on you know, some different shit like he was just saying he seen like so much torture happening to people down there in hell y'all and you know people gossiping if you gossip too much you're talking about other people you're going down there i ain't trying to say it. i ain't got no heaven in hell to put nobody in but from what dude was talking about i'm gonna make a video on that shit that shit was so powerful i ain't gonna lie i woke up this morning and watched that video i ain't even finished it i made it like probably 20 25 minutes in it was like a 53 minute almost an hour minute hour long video y'all and <clears throat> i gotta continue watching that shit probably tonight but he was saying some real powerful shit and it just made me think about life and my life and you know what I'm saying? The things that I've done wrong and that I should do better and stop doing and do more of, do less of. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's just this whole thing. And now I'm high and shit. Now, I'm... you know how you get the camera. Hold on. Let me make sure it's recording. Yeah, y'all. The camera had cut off again. I don't know. This camera, like, I guess to hold and preserve battery, 
cameras will turn off on it. I'm learning my camera, y'all. I'm literally learning. I have a relationship with my camera. Like how I'm building a relationship with y'all. I'm building a relationship with my camera. I'm building a relationship with God. You know what I'm saying? I'm just in a season of building. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all understand that though. Like, if things ain't going how you want in life, maybe you sometimes need to take a step back and look at yourself and see why it's, you know, really not going the way you want to. And maybe it's God's way of trying to open your eyes before it's too late too. To get on the right track you know what i'm saying like y'all i ain't just like y'all i just started doing youtube for real in 2021 i've been wanting to do youtube since i was 17 though i was gone off of youtube for almost 11 months i haven't even been consistently on youtube for a year yet i'm three months shy though i'm three months shy and three more months y'all i'll be able to say i've been on youtube for a whole year consistently without having any too many breaks you know what i'm saying like i might have had two or three weeks here and that's because <clears throat> you know and, and when i was fucking with my phone y'all the story i recently just had a uh, storage problem the last two days y'all don't even know that but uh we got it back right though because i know what, I, what to do now you know what i'm saying but yeah y'all when i was recording off of my phone i would go two and three weeks without dropping a video if you know you know but i don't really do that if i have you know what i'm saying if i can control that you feel what i'm saying so but other than that, y'all, I've literally almost been back for a whole year. So if you've been rocking with me since last year of May, you you know this already. We coming up on that year. That year back. You feel what I'm saying? And just this year alone coming back, I feel much better going into <clears throat> the next years ahead of me. You know what I'm saying? Because I literally stopped recording videos <clears throat> for 10 months and some change, y'all. Damn near fucking a year. And... Yeah, man, so I, I'm still kind of, basically what I'm saying is I'm still new to this YouTube shit, y'all. But I want my subscribers to have the type of mindset I get. Like, if you watching me, you, you gotta, in a way, feel me, right? You know what I'm saying? Because I know when I'm watching other people, I gotta feel them in some type of way, relate to them in some type of way for me to watch them. You feel what I'm saying? And I know a lot of people can relate. <clears throat> Shout out to LOL for saying that my camera is fire. Shout out to you, LOL. New camera look fire. Thank you so much. Uh, it's a grind. You know what I'm saying? You work hard for what you want in life, bro. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people ain't willing to put in that work. But I ain't gonna lie, y'all. The sativa hit. The sativa hit. I'm gonna have to say some of that sativa and then smoke some of the other one real quick. Matter of fact, I'm gonna do that right now on camera. Fuck you. Fuck it, what we got to lose? What we got to lose, bro? I'm gonna put Sativa back in her bag because this bitch I ain't gonna lie. She's smoking. She's smoking. She got me hot. She got me hot. So, therefore, she gotta go back in the motherfucking bag. She got me hot, but y'all, I ain't gonna lie. I'm feeling this Sativa. But we finna fuck with the uh, hybrid real quick. It's the only one I didn't smoke. Of course, I'm not finna smoke the whole one. Y'all, I, I am dropping videos of this on my Patreon. So, if you want to see, like, the weed, <clears throat> for real, like, if you really want me to show these hoes, I, I got it on my Patreon. You feel what I'm saying? Uh, I even bust one down and sprinkled a little bit of weed on this tray so y'all can see how it look and shit. All that's gonna be on the Patreon, so make sure that y'all go fuck with the Patreon. You feel what I'm saying? So here we go with the high. We got the hybrid. We smoking on that hybrid now. Sativa out of there. That Sativa low-key got me. I ain't gonna lie. Sativa kind of got me fried. And it's not the overly fried either. It's just like I'm fried, bro. Like I'm chilling right now, <laughs> y'all. Ain't gonna lie. So here we go. Make sure y'all hitting that like button, subscribing to the channel if you're not subscribed already, and tap that notification bell, y'all, so y'all can be notified when your girl Shade of Goat is dropping another video. Oh. Oh, that one was a, this was probably the spiciest one, y'all. 
And if y'all smoke pre-rolls before y'all know, I was watching uh, Mr. TAC last night. He was talking about like spicy uh, pre-rolls, but they have gotten better. <clears throat> I ain't used to smoke pre-rolls back in my rookie years, y'all. So this is new to me for real, but this one got a little spice. I ain't gonna lie. Damn, that be a chin, though. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I'm fried. I'm fried. Can y'all see the oil of that bitch? I'm fried. This bitch hitting. This is a little spicy, but. <coughs> it's hitting. Shout out to the smoke shop. Hey, I'm. <coughs> Damn. Hey, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, go to gang. I'm fried. You can see it in my eyes a little bit too. They glossing up and shit. I ain't gonna lie. And look, my SD card already full, but this is the only 32 gigabytes. Thank God I got two more. And I got one that's over 130 uh, gigs, I think. So I'm really good. And I'm erasing shit out my uh, camera, y'all. So I'm really good. But my camera did stop recording because it was full, my nigga. So, yeah, I gotta get used to that shit, man. What you mean, you fool, nigga? What you mean, you fool? But that's how you know your girl really putting in work. I'm really getting these videos out here for y'all, man. I hope y'all really enjoy this video, man. Listen, <clears throat> if you where I'm from and shit like that, don't be scared to fuck with the smoke shots, man. Save a little bread. Still get high, man. Well, nowadays, the shit that they putting in weed, even, bro, you can't really... You can't really be too trusting, man. So listen, y'all, can y'all even see it in my, like, can y'all see it in my eyes a little bit? They glossy a little bit, y'all, I ain't gonna lie. They real glossy. They glossy as hell. Can y'all tell? <laughs> can y'all tell, man? They glossy in the motherfucker. But man, I'm feeling good. The sativa and the indica and the hybrid, all three of the motherfuckers got me feeling good. Uh, man, I really rocks with y'all, man. My last video did get age restricted. The Mike Tyson raps. Make sure y'all go check that video out and go check out every video that I've ever posted. You feel what I'm saying? But listen, it's only up from here. It's gonna continue getting better. I want y'all to know that I'm talking to y'all. Y'all need to know that if you really rock with your girl, spread some love and some positivity. Share the video. Share the channel, share the love, man. Where's the love? But yeah, man, I'm high, man. I ain't gonna lie, I'm fried, I'm feeling good. Smoke shop weed ain't all that bad. I'll give it a seven overall. It's the one I go to. I don't know where y'all go to, but the one I give, go to, I, I give it a little seven. I know it's better, better than, it's better smoke shops than that. I'm already knowing, but y'all, I ain't gonna lie, we gonna be hitting up the dispensary soon. I don't know when, but we're going to hit up the dispensary and, and get them a shot. It ain't like I ain't never smoked dispensary weed before, but we finna get them a real chance to prove themselves too. You feel what I'm saying? And we were just finna be coming with more, more content. Not even just smoke videos. So y'all get ready too for some real adventures, some real, you know what I'm saying? But make sure y'all like this video. Subscribe to your girl Shade of Goat and tap that notification bell so you can be notified whenever your girl is dropping. A video y'all not gonna wanna miss. I love y'all. We out.